guys welcome to the channel in today's video i'm going to show you how to go ahead and deposit money into your bybit account so wherever you are in the world you can actually watch this video and you'll be able to deposit money into your bybit account instantly so the first thing you want to do is to make sure you know the particular assets you want to deposit into your account and in order for you to deposit money into your account you need a stable coin like usdt now once you know that you want to you are going to deposit your city into your account the next thing you want to do is to go ahead and tap on the more section to go to p2p section so on this section now you have to look for p2p this is p2p right here on the buy section click on p2p then it's going to pop up the p2p section of bybit now this is what you need to do what you need to do is to go ahead and tap on any of the trader above most traders they have their um requirements before you can actually trade with them and this are uh, the stable coin you can only trade usdt and usdt this usdc these are the two stable coins to trade in order for you to get money into your bank account so this is the amount in my in my local currency which is naira you can actually change the currency here to whatever currency you want even in ghana even in canada wherever you are in the world you can actually select the currency there then the next thing you want to do is click on buy and you put in the amount with your fiat currency use the fiat the fiat currency is using your local currency inputting is the put in the local currency let me say for example fifty thousand. i put the amount i can buy fifty thousand from this person the person is saying the value okay the minimum this person says is um okay this okay um so i think this person has minimum amount to use i don't know why it's not working from the for this person okay let's just say this is the amount you want to buy from this user then you click on buy i want to click on buy if i click on buy now you notice it would okay you notice it would generate the it generates a payment method where i can go ahead and transfer money into it but right now i don't know why i can't trade with that particular user let me go find that user let me come to this and i'll just put in okay this one is trading 10 let me just say 30 okay say 2000 why is it not going i can't even put any amount let's just put all okay so this is the amount the person wants to trade oh i don't know some people's order are very small on the market i don't know why why it's small but basically once you've done that it's going to show you the person's bank account bank details where you need to send the money to all right you can see this person's you can see this person's name you can see right here it will give you the person's account the person's account number we are going to go ahead and send money into it all right you should give you person's account number where you go ahead and send money into it and that's all so if i click on pay now it's going to give me a bank account number where i'm going to send that money and once i send the money then i can go ahead and confirm my order right here then the person is going to release the coin for me I'll cancel this order then go back so once you've received your coin your coin will be in the assets section that's this in the asset section under funding they're going to have your assets there and in order for you to transfer your assets to sports it's very easy you click on transfer and you click on the particular asset you want to i'll switch this then you want to transfer your account you want to transfer from funding to sports you change it to sports then select the currency for the coin which is usdt then you put in the amount then you confirm and it's going to confirm it's going to send to your spot account instantly so that's it guys and also get and deposit money into your private account